What's going on, everybody? It's Big T back with another episode of Grounded. Last time we left off, we uh, were right here in Dr. Tully. Oh, wait. Explore the lab for signs of Dr. Tully. Yes. In Dr. Tully's secret undershed lab. And uh, apparently this is a mant. A mantis? Some kind of human praying mantis? I, I'm really not sure what's going on at this point, but I appreciate y'all tuning in uh, to the video and the series. We are just about to hop right back into it, and it says everything is locked. So I'm wondering if I can hit this with a repair arrow, maybe? Oh. Oh. I'm holding raw science in my hands. Okay, well, I know I don't want to fall so before we you know i mean before i do fall by the power of helion champion of the sun do i drop down and fight his ass not with this shitty mosquito needle there's no way now if i could hit him from up top with some arrows? Because I've got, yo, check my 32 feather arrows. Hell, I thought I had, I thought I had some different arrows too, but I guess not. Man, I think, I think we might have to fight him. I'm not seeing any other options. Yeah, it's, oh, it's right there. It's right there. That is it. Okay, so. I gotta, I gotta jump down. Okay. Praying Mantis boss fight. Take one. Let me see if I can just, if I could bait him. Where's he at? Oh shit. Oh, there he is. Wait, is this? That ain't glass. What in the fucking shit? Oh my. So I'm just. So I'm just fucking dead. There's really unauthorized access. Unauthorized access. Throw that bitch. Huh? Oh. Oh my god, he just dropped a fucking ant in here with me. As if he wasn't hard enough as it is. Now I got like an infected ant. Oh. Actually, that's a good idea right there, ain't it? Dumbass. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there is no way. Got you now, bitch. Ah! Yes, yes. Get absolutely fucked, Mr. Mant. Oh my God, that that cannot be harder than the Black Widow. 
or easier than the Black Widow? Like, I just don't even understand what that was. A massive creature constructed by Dr. Wendell Tully as the last vessel in which he could escape his fate, inspired by the classic creatures from the Minotaurs and Mere whatever the fuck tabletop game. Wow. Thank God he had weakness to stabbing, because I did stab the shit out of him a lot if I could get all my arrows back too. That was something that I did not plan to do. That I but okay. And it doesn't even let you Yeah, it doesn't even let you press the buttons until Until you kill him. How do I oh I gotta hold it down. Whew. My needle is almost gone. I gotta repair my needle. Or just use my damn thing. Okay. Wow. Alright, let's continue on. So like was that I guess that was not Dr. Tully? Not totally. Totally sure. I need some damn. Still got some heal bosses. Okay. You may have defeated my mant, but you and your ominous paymasters will never get their hands on the embiggening cocktail. I'll take that secret to my grave. To my grave! <laughs> this is... This is getting the intense, bro. Becomes the watcher. This is getting... intense. Does it feel good? Wait, he's in here? Oh my god. Well, here I am, Wendell Tully in all his glory. What the fuck? Sure, not who I expected. My apologies for uh, all of that. I thought you were agents of Ominent to come for me at last. <laughs> Psych! I am. How should I know what guys Schmechter's agents would come shrouded in? The subterfuges of your ilk know no limits. Still, you do seem a bit young to be in the employ of Ominent. Oh, what have I done? I... I... Well, there is not much I can say to that. Yeah. It may have been Schmechter and his corporate goons that pulled the switch, but it is still my invention and my responsibility to think that you have been caught up in all of this. Your children, not much older than my Sarah or Thor. Oh, what has become of me? Threatening death to children. But, but also, what are you doing here? Well, that's fair. I have no doubt terrible things have brought you here. Yeah, man. Terrible things that are undoubtedly my fault. I never meant to hurt anyone. I don't dis... Speaking of forgiveness, please excuse my shriveled appearance. This blasted... Like the grape set out in the sun. The body shrivels, withers, desiccates becoming a husk of what Tweet by fast stop news. In essence, what you see here before you, in all its unholy glory, the withered man. Can I be raised? Well, if you will allow me to check your... You've been in the yard for over a month. Yeah. I'm sure the signs of raisining were... Nothing in my research has shown that there is any immunity to it, and yet here you are. Perhaps it is that your 
youthful bodies are more resistant than others. Likely, this is why Armament was experimenting on children to begin with. Which means, did Schmechter find a cure? Damn! As much as I loathe the man, I must admit that Schmechter is brilliant in his own way, though his methods can be quite distasteful. We cannot rule out the possibility that he has done it. Could that mean there is hope for me? Why are you hiding here, man? When the raisining became too much, I realized I had to find a cure before it was too late. I hid here, away from the eyes. So many ominent has always wanted to steal my work. They would never admit it's what I have made many mistakes in my life. Countless, really. But one that I will never make again is to allow my discoveries to fall into the hands of that corporation. If I must die for it, so be it. I need to go home, man. Home. Oh, yes. Yes, of course. Home. Your parents must be worried. So very worried. The process is not difficult. You will simply need to brew an embiggening cocktail at the Javamatic machine. Okay. The embiggening process is extremely taxing on living subjects. You'll need enough nutrients and proteins to survive the expansion to your original size. We use the embiggening cell to regulate this expansion by way of the secret cocktail. The ingredients in the cocktail, like the keratin in toenails, fortify the skeletal structure as it grows. Unfortunately, there is this small issue of overexpansion. If the subject grows too quickly, they are prone to overexpansion, or in layman's terms, they explode. Oh, great. To counter this, Sustained infusions of carbon dioxide gas must be added to the mixture. Fortunately, I found a secret ingredient that works perfectly in this regard. Grilled science. Grilled science! Raw science represents the essence of ingenuity, but thrown over the coals of fire, it is tempered by flame, tamed by Burgle's spatula, and emerges as something greater, plump and juicy. Grilled science. It reminds me of the barbecues we once had in our backyard. Oh, Trudy, Sarah, Thor. The last of the grilled science is in the refrigerated storage room over there. You got some grilled science? Collect grilled science. Oh my god, he does. This is insane. Are you ready to go? We'll need some grilled science. I got it. Good. Good. Then we have everything we need to proceed. I promise I will get you home. I doubt it. I may have failed my own children, but I will not fail you. Oh, from the mouths of babes. Yes, you may be right. It might not be too late for me. But what is most important is getting you home. Facts. We need to head to the Javamatic machine in the upper yard. There we can blend the embiggening cocktail needed to run the spacer safely. Okay. I'm opening the back door for you. You'll follow close? Oh my god, you're actually following me. Okay, um... Wait. Which door did you open? Okay. We going this way? I think we're going this way. This seems... This seems correct. 750 meters away, Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm outside. Thank God, I'm never going back under the shed. Fuck the Black Widow. Fuck all of that. Is he behind me? Oh, he is. Oh! Don't hit me. What in the fuck? 
kind of ant is that? An orc? Bro. Can we just... Let's just run. Oh. Miss me, bitch. Everything looks good from here. Sounds good, brother. Just keep it moving. It's 700 meters away. I just... I don't know if we'll make it. I can't believe... I really never thought that, like, Dr. Wendell Tully was going to be a real character in which we could interact with in game and yet here he is just floating around as a head just don't know what could possibly be waiting for us around here we got a couple ladybugs which that's no problem All right, I'm gonna just I'm gonna keep walking, uh, running Tully over here, and we'll uh, we'll see if we brew it. Okay, we're getting close. There's a zip line here, so let's just <laughs> the Javamatic machine. That's no standard model Javamatic. I should have known it was just gonna be a fucking coffee maker. Okay, install the embiggening cell in the Javamatic carafe. Um, so go up top. I think. See some science. I feel like I need to, like, drop down, right? Or something. They got a whole damn thing up here. Uh, let me just. Oh. Well. Really did not. Scientific breakthrough. Want to run out of that? And I'm on the ground. Can I just bust? Oh shit! Explosive. Um. Yeah. Fuck. It. Watch out, Tully! Damn, son! Almost fucked you up. Come on, then. The embiggening cell is in place. We're almost ready to commence brewing. Hold up, now I gotta go up top. <clears throat> know what ingredients I have. I saw something online that gave um, a list of things you would need on this mission and so I did spend some time gathering things. Like I got some gum. The toenails was on there so maybe that's this part. Oh shit it is. Yeah. Oh I need one more toenail though. Are you kidding me? Where can I get Another toenail. Hold up. Let me Google it real quick. Toenails. Grounded. Location. Toenails are a resource found throughout the upper yard, such as in the dirty ashtray, in a black widow cave, and scattered on the floor of the upper grasslands, which I want to say that's where we are. I could I think devour a Billy Hawk right about now. I'm pretty sure we are in the upper grassland. So let me um, let me run around for at least a couple minutes and see if I can find a damn toenail. Found a milk molar. We'll take that. Okay, I looked up a video that said there might be one. I think it's this pipe. Yeah, there we go. There's a toenail right there. All right, we're gonna bust this bad boy up and then head back. 
to our destination. Let's go, Tully. Okay, we're almost back up. The toenail has been harvested. And it is finally time to craft the embiggening cocktail. It's been a long time coming. Now I gotta go all the way back down. Seems right. Well done. Perhaps you could get a job at the Gitten Jet as a barista. Assuming Maybe. all goes to plan, of course. And you're old enough to comply with any labor laws. Okay, now we just hit the hit the button. Okay. Insufficient what? Power. Oh. That did not it look looks right. like there are still a few bugs left in the system. <clears throat> we'll need to get down there and repair those mixer modules. Okay, the mixers have been repaired and defended. Now, finally, hopefully we can retrieve the embiggening cell. This has been a long time coming. I can't believe we're actually here. I honestly, I did not think that the grounded story was going to end this way with you working with and meeting Dr. T <laughs> I can't get over it, bro. It's too weird. It's too weird. How did I, um, how did I get up to dude? Okay, here we go. I could devour a billy hog right about now. I know you could, brother. I know you could. Okay, here we go. There it is. Excellent. Cell wow. integrity appears nominal. You might be the best assistant I've ever had. Thanks, man. Don't tell Burgle that. He's just looking for an excuse to use that grilling function. Anyway, back to the spacer. Maybe we can get you home before dinner. Tweet Thank you, Dr. Tully. Years. Okay, you found the filled embiggening cell. Okay, let's head back to the spacer, and then um, we'll see if we get to go home. In-game music, like, like we finally did it, you know what I mean? This sounds like the ending scene of a great movie. Which maybe it is. Maybe it is. I feel like I'm watching the final scene of Top Gun. Like they just completed the mission or whatever. Which it might be, ain't it? Or nah. Oh shit, this is that thing I built. I did this once. Oh shit. Just gotta make sure I don't die now. Okay. Back to the pond. Almost there. So close now, I'm just trying not to disturb that orb weaver. I think we're home free. 100 meters away. Oh. Wait, oh yeah, there's a... Oh, shit! What is it? What is it? What is that? It sounds like a fucking spider, dude. I don't know. Where? Here? Put it in. Turn on the spacer to go home. We can't. We can't talk. Okay, we can talk. Well, here we are. Back where it all began. Yeah. We better get you back to your families. I suspect they're worried sick about you. What about your family? Perhaps they are worried about me still, but I know that I put them through a lot. I only hope that they know how much I love them. But there's no sense in being so glum. 
I haven't quite yet reached the end of my road, though. Huh? What happened? Are you ready to get out of here? Um. Of I still have questions. What do you think? Are you gonna be okay? Concern, but I don't deserve it after all you've suffered on my account. Don't worry about me. Whatever. Oh my god. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I understand. Thank you. Dialing? Virgo here. After our call, would you be in For the last time, Virgo, no! I do not want any more of these confounded follow-up surveys. The answer is adequate. Always adequate. Adequate? Now, listen to me. This is your manager speaking. We're about to fire up the spacer. I need you to keep an eye on the raw science convergence coupling. The last thing we need is an overload spike. True. Hey, you are leaving. Have you been dissatisfied with my service? Don't worry. I'll come back for you when things calm down in the real world. But it... Oh my god. Are you ready to get out? This is it, my young friend. Uh... I just... I can't even finish this because... Goddamn soldiering. Oh. How did I just... Come here. I know y'all probably can't even see shit. It's hella dark. Oh my god, dude. He's, he's so fast. I'm trying to jump shot him. Oh, I just... I can't... Oh, shit. Okay. Are you ready to get out of here? I'm ready. Okay, then. For science! Look, I ain't even get to hug him. This is it? Oh, my God. This is it. I flipped the switch. No way it actually works, right? Damn. And with a flash, that was the end of the tiny adventure of a lifetime. At least that's what the local papers called it. It's hard to believe how much has happened since then. Pete, Max, Willow, and Hoops tried to tell everyone what had happened. But without evidence, no one believed them. No. Instead, people heralded Ominent's amazing new invention. A shrinking machine. And everyone learned the name of the one behind it all. Director Dalton Schmachter. It didn't end there. The world found out about me, about the raisining, and I had to disappear and hide away, which meant all I could do was watch as Schmechter took credit for everything that I had achieved. Damn it, Schmechter. Kids tried to get back to their normal lives as best they could. Burgle has been keeping an eye on them in my stead, joining their science and robotics club. They made him the mascot, but they didn't tell him that part. I can't help thinking that there was more I could have done with my time in the yard. That said, I have my wife, my family, and I can continue my research, such that it is trying to make the most of what little time that I have remaining. You love to see it. Game report card. 58 days in the yard. Is that real time? Three deaths. That I know that's amazing. a lot.
Oh, that's because every time I die, I would just load a new game instead of instead of actually dying and, and respawning. Only 39 perfect blocks. Yeah, I wasn't very good at that. Thank you for playing. Thank you for letting me play. Tweet by because Delta that game one. was actually incredible. Wait, so question is, do we still get to roam the yard? That's just like the story, right? It doesn't actually like kick us out of the the yard, does it? Or does it? Damn, wait, it really does. You gotta start like a new game or something? What the fuck? I guess if I wanted to continue on, I could load an old one, but okay. We finished the story of Grounded. I know it took, uh, I know it took a, a little bit to finish this series and, and we went a bit off and on, but um, wow incredible survival game um i don't know if this will be the last that i play of grounded but there are some more games coming out that i want to check out obviously sons of the forest new uh survival game that i am super excited to uh to check out and play so that's probably where i'm gonna be over the next um you know week or two um but you never know we might come back to uh to grounded circle around when things get slow because I do feel like there's still a lot fighting the Black Widow, the Brood Mother, um, a lot of the kind of optional bosses and things that we could take on, but I probably got to level up my character quite a bit in order to uh, to beat all those. So anyway, thank you all so much for tuning into the series. I do appreciate it and I will catch you right back here next time. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like if you didn't just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really